everybody, it's Oracle684 back here again with a video, and I want to tell you guys something I've been watching over the uh, past Memorial Day weekend uh, videos, live streaming of the Friday the 13th game that came out on, uh, that basically came out uh, a couple days ago. Uh, I'm sure you had all the betas and all that, all that goody stuff out there. It's uh, Right now it's a uh, online uh, multiplayer game. Uh, they're gonna, eventually going to make it into a uh, one-player campaign. It's one-player game, basically. And I've been a huge fan of this franchise since I was like four or five years old. Love them. Uh, everybody knows me that Part 2 is the favorite. Uh, I love the first four films along with the uh, two Kane Hunter ones that uh, he did for Paramount. And I, love, uh, you know, Jason X. I mean, sure, yeah, I'm a Jason X fan, but going back to uh, the game itself, it, uh, but watching the gameplay, watching, you know, uh, all these YouTubers, and, you know, I don't play video games much anymore. The last system I got is an Xbox 360. Uh, I mean, I can't keep up with, like, all the, uh, uh, all these systems and buying them, you know, I mean, I got, you know, other things I'm doing with my life right now. But, I mean, just watching the gameplay, it, it's it's fun. It's almost like you're actually inside the game itself. It, it feels like it. I mean, you know, I mean, if you're die hard, I haven't even gotten the, uh, the Chris Lake uh, Memories uh, Blu-ray DVD compact yet. I got the book that came out around, I think it's like 10 years ago now. Got the book. Love that stuff. And, you know, just, you know, watching the gameplay, seeing the different variations of Jason. They got Jason's, they got them all spot on and stuff. I mean, they got... Uh, Jason, you know, from part two, part three, spot on. Of course, you can tell when, you know, Jason's walking, it's Kane Hodder's stance because he did all the motion caps for it, which is I thought was badass. Uh, the gameplay itself, to me, I think it's, you know, I think they could have done better with it. I mean, they got three maps. There were, I mean, there was talks about them making a uh, part six map. Uh... I don't know whatever happened to that idea. I mean, you got the, uh, if I can pronounce it right, I, it's, in, it's in the favorite, my favorite film, uh, part two. The uh, location is uh, Patnek Lodge. They got that, and I think what they did with Crystal Lake and Higgins Haven and Patnek Lodge, what they did is they combined them all together, like on, maybe like on one map or something. I'm not really sure. But, I mean, I was expecting more and more maps, and there was a thing that they were having when, when uh, Kickstarter was making the game when they were saving up money uh, Gun Media was gonna gonna go ahead and have Mrs. Voorhees be a uh, playable character uh, maybe they might say that for the DLCs for the uh, PlayStation 4 or the console systems is what I'm gonna call it I hope that does happen because that would be awesome because right now the only characters we got from the actual movie is uh, Jason himself and then you got Tommy Jarvis kinda hoping they'd have like a little, a little more of the other characters from the actual films but you know, I guess I'm okay with that. I think what they could have actually added on too is more counselors, which would, would have been awesome instead of having like the same people play play uh, play the same character. Like you know, you one person's playing this this same character, the other person's playing the exact same character as the other one. Uh, I was watching a uh, YouTuber today. I actually just subscribed to her. Her name is uh, uh, April Thirteen Dawn. Really, really cool YouTuber. I have to agree with her too. It's I guess it's not the, the final product, and I talked to a buddy of mine, too, I was texting him uh, yesterday, and he said the game has like a lot of bugs on it, I didn't know that, I don't know really because what's going on there on that, that end, but I mean, I've been watching the live streams on YouTube, and to me the game looks great, I mean, it looks awesome, uh, but there are, you know, quite a few things, I'm not really going to name all of them, what they could have done better, but, you know, for one, I know the maps, they could have had more than three maps, I would have I loved to have seen a... Uh, Map for Part Six. Part Six is my favorite Friday the Thirteenth, but it, it it's you know very very different. Uh, if, if what Tom McLaughlin had to do with it, uh, but I'm actually sitting here. I'm watching Part Three right now. Part Three, awesome. Uh, you know they just looking at the barn and stuff and looking at the ranch house and, on Higgins Haven and looking at it in the game it's just you know they got it spot gun meter did a good job getting all the locations for the three maps spot on uh, just you know they're very very awesome a huge plus for those guys so yeah that's you know that I mean that's pretty much it 
The only other thing I don't like is I went on a GameStop website. This game is not advertised, and it came out a couple of days ago. Now, I know Gun Media is not a big, big video gaming making company like uh, uh, all the top names are out there, Ubisoft and you know so on. But I guess you have to order this game either online, or you probably have to go to Amazon or something to buy it or something. I don't know, but I just love watching it being played. I mean, I care less about actually, you know, playing the game, but I'm hoping if they got bugs, glitches, and, you know, stuff like that in there, they, that they correct them. Because this is what the fans wanted. I mean, you know, everybody backed up the Kickstarter uh, pack thing and wanted it. I never did. I uh, was going to uh, put my money into it unless I wanted to own it. Plus, I don't even, you know, got the PlayStation 4 or the Xbox One. Uh, don't know if I'll ever intend on doing that. I don't know if I'll ever come out of video game retirement. Pretty much, I just, you know, play this stuff when, you know, my niece, my niece or my uh, nephews are up and stuff like that. Or, you know, if a couple of buddies of mine, if I'm over at their house ever or so and they want to play, I'll play. But, of course, then I'll get my, you know, ass handed to me. But other than that, guys, that is it. I mean, this game looks awesome. I'm, I'm having a blast just uh, watching it being played over this hot, uh, Memorial Day weekend. And hope, you know, everybody enjoys this video. I know I had a blast making it. Uh, something different besides the uh, uh, talking about comics or graphic novels or superhero stuff. So, there we go. Take care. And bang.